Hello, Bishop Wooden here, and I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know where to start. I'm still rejoicing over the message that I heard uh, last night uh, preached by Elder Isaac Quick. Oh, my Lord, the young man, the Lord used him in a mighty way uh, here at our AIM convention. We're in the AIM convention of North Carolina third jurisdiction. It is our very first full-fledged, full-bore AIM convention, and I could not be happier. The night before last, the elder John Amon Chukwu preached the gospel of Jesus Christ with power and authority, and my, did the Lord move. We've had fantastic day services, and last night I stayed for the Revival Fire service, and and uh, Tria Perry and uh, uh, Tanisha Douglas, all those ladies ministered the word of God, and, and I was so blessed to hear the word of the Lord from them on last evening, and tonight, the president, the chairman of our AIM convention, Chairman Willie Bamberg, is going to preach the word of the Lord to us tonight. And I want to invite you out. I want you to come. Good things are happening. As I speak right now, we're having an awesome day session and uh, our young people are being poured into. Yes, poured into. The theme is the pressers pressing together to experience the power of God. Pressers. Who are the pressers? Pressers are people who hear the gospel, who see the kingdom, who hear the gospel of the kingdom, who see the move of God in the earth. And guess what? They respond not by running away from it, not by trying to be neutral, not by trying to be worldly, not by trying to pretend that you don't know what's going on, but they respond to it by running toward it pressing into it the most dangerous place in the world in the world is to stand between oppressor and the move of god because i'm telling you right now we're gonna run over you <laughs> so i'm excited as you can see i want to invite you to come out tonight and another reason that i'm excited as i close this is that i am working on the message that god has given me and I, listen i really want to tell you about it because yours truly will be ministering tomorrow night and I'm honored to be to have this privilege. Had a meeting today with our supervisor, Supervisor Dijanae. What an awesome woman of God she is. So many wonderful things are coming uh, are on the docket, I'm telling you. She said some things today that were so powerful. I'll reveal them to you later that it took, I, I, had, to, I, it, I had to grab hold of myself to keep from shedding tears. First Lady Lat Latrice Scott, uh, Supervisor Scott was in the meeting with us and it was just so profound and so powerful. But God has given me a message uh, for tomorrow night, Friday night here at the AIM conference that you want to hear, that you must hear. You have to come out and hear the word of the Lord going to make you love God more. Embrace the Lord. Because my friends, it is a blessing to know Jesus and to be saved and to be living holy in a day like today. Tonight our chairman, I can hardly wait to hear him minister the word of the Lord. Chairman Willie Bamberg will be ministering the word of the Lord. And I want you to come. I want you to come. And if you come, you're going to be glad you came. And on tomorrow evening, this word that God has given me, I want to, I want to tell you about, I want to give you the name of it. I want to give you my text and where I'm coming from, but got to wait. And uh, we're going to preach the word of God and the Lord is going to bless us real good. Now I'm signing out because you know, I can get long with these things, but I pray that you're having a good day. I pray that you love the Lord. I pray that when you see this, that, uh, that, that we say something to bring a smile to your face, to inspire you, to keep serving the Lord. And I know some of you, you're tired, you had a long day at work, but ask God to refresh, refresh you. Come on out and watch God move. We are going to enjoy the God of the Bible at the AIM Conference for North Carolina Third Jurisdiction. God bless you.